Do you know that scene in Battle Royale? That Japanese movie where all the kids get put on an island so that they can go kill each other off because the adults just won't tolerate their shit anymore. And then some people have like a ballista and others have a garbage can lid. Imagine being Welcome sent into the world. A deathmatch in the world and all you have is the lid of a garbage can. Being so poorly equipped certainly seems like an unfair shake in life. That's how I felt when I opened my inbox today and it said, Hey Grubby, I don't know how this works. So I'll just throw this out here. Back in the early 2000s, my friend told me about ghoul rush. What do you do is instead of gathering wood, you sent your ghoul to harass the opponent. I ended up sending my ghoul to gather wood in the opponent's base. And when he asked in chat WTF I was doing, I casually replied, I'm just gathering some wood. So Dan, stand ready. That's it? Anyway, I feel like this strategy is a definite killer and a winner and you need to play two on two and both undead. Okay, so what seems to be the problem here is that <laughs> I'm getting tower rush as well. I was gonna gather wood here, but I think this, this game has just taken a completely different turn. Halt! In the name of the law! What's going on here? Let's make the vampire hero we heard so much about. <laughs> what is going on? Sending a ghoul to gather woods in the enemy's base gone wrong. <laughs> He's using my previous strategy against me, but he didn't know that my base is forfeitable because I could just gather woods in his base. How much wood would a woodchuck know? It would not work. Okay. Was, <laughs> where are you going? No. Oh. Uh oh. Okay. I was going to gather. Yep. Okay. Well. No comment. Go, go next. No comment. Can you mimic peasant death sound? Go next. I go next game. That one hurts a bit. Ghoul Rush pretty OP. Anyway, I feel like this strategy is a definite killer and a winner. You need to play two on two and undead. Back then, I never did a single game of one on one, only two on two or three v three. Strange. Strange, he said to himself. That is strange. Weird. All right, so let's enact this strategy where we are only allowed to gather wood in his base. That's the strat. He didn't tell me what hero to make or why it's good. <laughs> you just gather wood in their base and then you go home. And that's about it. All right then. I this this just in. This strategy is rumored to be garbage. All right, we can deal with this peasant first. Angry cable car. That's interesting. Good start. Oh, militia. How do you know militia are never up to any good? It's in the name. They're malicious. Oh yes, I have no lumber. Okay, let's go DK first. And we'll make second Necropolis. Because we don't have another way to gather food. Okay. Only gather in his base. If we leave every peasant under half life, we can come in and coil everything. Yep. 
Yeah, yeah, yeah. Bring back the wood. Oh, Very good. Shit. We got our wood. Why cute? Oh, my bad. It's it's a habit. It's a rally point habit. Oh, I remember why I was doing it. I was doing it because uh, I needed wood. <laughs> it's a useful bad instinct. Bad instinct. Oh, and I needed space for the graveyard. That's why I was cutting that tree. No! Uh, put your bets. Will it survive? I knew it. Don't surround me, please. Oh, thank you. Thank you very much. This one for sure, miss. Oh, sh Let's just die. It was all a distraction to gather his trees. We have enough wood, I think. Normally you want only three ghouls on... Ouch! You only want three ghouls on wood normally. But I think considering the distance at which we have to go for it... Uh, we need a little bit more, but I think we have enough. So now we can make our real army. Which is, of course... I kind of have to fill in the gaps here, if I'm being honest. But it is, of course... Mass Acolyte. I'm an experienced strategy interpreter. And I believe that what the guy was trying to say is that you should go Mass Acolyte with this. There, we'll heal up. He doesn't like me to touch his wood. I see. He's maliciously responding. My patience has ended. Return wood? Oh, yes. Reminds me of uh, Nishka in Firefly. You do not like I killed this man. No. I'm sure it's fine. He's probably a very bad man. My wife's cousin. Uh-oh. No! Ouch. Nice. Uh, he's got boots of speed. Tough. Death hour would help. Yeah. Let's go creeping. Oh, not, not with this. No! Your brazen... brazenness knows no limits. Oh god. Okay, I think we have enough wood from his base. We have completed the strategy. Now let's go to part number two. If the guy is interested in seeing his strategy come to life, I think we can all say that we've completed his Make-A-Wish. Now let's make it a bit grubby. 
Death shall rain. Oh, he's towering us. No, come on. Massive damage. I am sanctified! This is where the movie preview would start and it would go a little something like this. You're probably wondering how I ended up here. <laughs> and then a couple of uh, juicy bits, juicy clips. We can take an expansion. We have enough acolytes. I think we need 100 population acolytes to beat the Mountain King. That little pity patty sound. Oh, nicely. Nicely done, Ogre. I could have, of course, expanded before finishing it. This camp might be hard. Did you guys know that Undead has no regen outside of Blight and un Unholy Aura? So if I didn't get Unholy, none of this healing would... Uh, none of these guys would heal. I have to completely rely on aggro toggling to keep them alive. And he's here. Gonna holy light kill me, isn't he? We're cool. We have protection. That's so sad. That cost me quite a bit. That was not cheap. Now the question is, does he have an expansion? Not yet. My hope is he comes early. And uh, we debate him to overcommit on my uh, DK. <laughs> my 
I was busy surrounding! Give me a break! <laughs> Come on! I wish I yes, master. My life would as well. More Summon gold I will, I wish only to serve. More gold My patience has ended. Where shall my blood be spilled? My fate is sealed. I will be done. Yes, master. My patience has ended it, master. I wish only to find their soul. But my fate is sealed. I am this. I am let me see my life for this. This had to be done. Okay, then he bashes me to death. Okay, uh, tough, but not unwinnable. Well, why am I taking an acolyte of gold to build? <laughs> I feel like I have enough redundancy here. Old habits. For different times, happier times. Even here, I'm still forced to pull acolytes from gold because I couldn't spare one little extra building acolyte. Uh, fun story. Did you know that when the game came out, I thought for sure the way that Undead is going to be played is that you always make one extra acolyte to build all your buildings so that you don't have to lose resources. It makes sense when you think about it. Like it's efficient. That's what I did. Yeah. Oh, we can buy the lion, lion horn of Stormwind. That we uh, sold. I wish all my patience has ended. Thy my fate is yours. I vow. Yes. Where shall my life be still? I vow. Well, massive damage. They die so fast, the peasants. Let light cease. Death back. Alright. Uh oh, uh oh. Did you see that teleport? Did you see the teleport hack? Thanks, Reforged. Oh. 
<laughs> this is uh, basically the Fast and the Furious strategy. Just make more. People love this shit. Way more than ever needed to be made. He ruined the song. Yeah, Blight works really well. Flyings! <laughs> I can't deal with those. Let's get an orb. Imagine if he had clap. You know, he's actually surrounded. Oh. If he gets surrounded without TP, he will die. Oh god. We have to kill shop first. Okay. Job well done. Go back for a little regen. Where shall my blood be spilled? I still make the same mistake. We've got bonus acolytes. We don't need to do this. can expand again I think we can just hire two tavern heroes to deal with the uh, griffins if he doesn't get too many just need to make sure to have enough towers so we don't lose our base how much gold is there left 4k 15 how many acolytes is that six 5500 gold guys how much is that how many acolytes? Naga Panda? No, when, when you count the air, there's always an alchemist. So alchemist and something. Maybe Beastmaster with quill picks? It's gotta be tanky. Otherwise, it's going to get nuked. Lost a couple of acolytes, it's fine. Actually, much easier than I thought. Great item. We can now reskill away from Unholy Aura. Where shall I 
Oh shit. Okay, he might have an expansion again. Let's get our tavern heroes. Retrain. Alchemist Beastmaster. Acid Bomb. Figgies. This is gonna work. These are the best anti air you can get. And then we can sneak a couple of acolytes here and expand again. I am sanctified! Damn it! How long did I not kill that Heward? I feel like it's been there for a bit. have much money left. Ah, oh, damn it. Run! What are you doing? I need mana pot. He has one more healing ward. One more mana pot, maybe. Maybe I should make some other units? Oh.
Good thing we found that aura. Now we've got all these useful abilities. Five mana. Ah, we killed him before he had mana. It was so close. Twenty-four and a half mana. Oops. He killed my gold mine. Luckily, we didn't break our holy pact of not making any other units. Our viewer would have been so disappointed. That's a lot of griffins. Hmm. Anime dead. Disease clouded. Acolytes. More gold. What about this? Oh. So we need the other red spot. Or this base. We could take this base. So it's a lot of acolytes against a lot of griffins. I like those odds. Oops. Ouch. Oh, he's gonna stop my non-existent expo. <laughs> oh shit, we showed him. Oh, we showed him. Luckily, we found a replenishment potion for our beast master. Unluckily, he will not live long. What lies before me? I'm actually bound. Oh shit, Shredder. Hey, if he's such a fan of cancelling ziggurats, I can get some free hits in. I never thought I'd say it, but I've run out of acolytes. I'll shake that right up. My patience has 
Denied. For Cosmo Dawn? That was not a lot of life. What's he gonna drink? You call. Come here. My Come here, cutie pie. Let battle be oh no, it's a race. Okay, let's get back. Uh, he's probably still chasing. Yeah. Uh, maybe brilliance. Ah, uh, true shot. No, no. Helm of Valor. Okay, okay. Ta Talisman of evasion. Maybe. Ouch. I don't think he's mining top left, is he? I did see peasants coming from there, so I'm kind of suspicious. I should have checked his items to be sure. I don't see any items, but he could have sold them by now. Okay, that's not gonna work. Wait, of course he did! He has endurance! Of course he freaking did! Where else do you get endurance? I mean, he could have bought it, but I don't think so. <laughs> He's too fast. I am I wish to serve. I will die. Patience has a high power. Vengeance is yours. Yeah. As you order, I bow. What lies before me? You call. Oh. He did not take it. All right, I have a plan. Next time he staffs his paladin, we're gonna blow him up. If he shows up again, he's probably healing. Wait, why did I buy talisman? I already had one. <laughs> this master could have lived. Okay, Mount King, Mount King, Mount King. <laughs> okay, one shot. Okay, that's nice. All right. <laughs> Why does Griffin one shot? All right, I'll be right back. I like I bow to your will. My vengeance is yours. I should start making altars by the double. But here's a plan. If we give so much health to a hero, 
Because they can't die anymore, he will stop focusing them. Medallion of Courage? Perfect. Perfect, we get that too. And then Belt of Giant Strength as well. Now surely they cannot die yeah. anymore. For the Lich King. There we go. Yeah, this guy has 1200 health. Oh, He's sure used to Alchemist being like really weak. Let's send him in <laughs> and see what he says. Let's see what he will do. Remember me? Oh, you went. No, no, you went for the wrong one. Okay, that's fine. Like, oh! Alchemist not so weak anymore, is he? Haha! Well, he, he doesn't have enough armor, is the main issue. Okay, man. I think I have to make some gargoyles. I'm gonna break my holy vow of no unit. Split up. Kirby already came so far. <laughs> I cannot finish him. You guys... You see it. We're not breaking through. He's gonna be level 10-10. Wrong mindset. All right, no gargs, but I'll heal up with statue. I think you need more. What did Ninja say again? The phrase "it's just the game" is such a weak mindset. You're okay with what happened, losing imperfection of a craft. There's always something to learn, always room for improvement, never settle. When you stop getting angry after losing, you've lost twice. Okay. Do not accept loss ever. Noted. Oh, that's perfect. I'll shake that right up. You got it. Who knew that there'd still be creeps on the map? Don't rush me. You guys are right. Thank you for helping me believe in myself. Okay, I'm believing a little bit less in myself. I need a pep talk again. <laughs> Help. More acolytes. One final fight. We can do it, right, guys? Where shall my blood be? 
Thy bidding, master. Wanna blow something up? Yes, and. Oh, Anka for incarnation. Very good. So I think we should have left those statues at home. With new evidence that came to light. He's feeling pretty comfy. Is he overstaying? No, he had a good sense of how long he can stay. Oh, ruined bracers. Hell yeah. And the 50 minute tower rush. As you do. It was too much when he saw the ziggurats and the 112th acolyte. <laughs> Kirby, I think we might need some shades. That's okay, this game threw enough shade, Fuzzy Pulse Jackson. Oh, it's over, finally. Oh. This started with mining lumber in his base. I feel like I misread his instructions. It's when I called IKEA and I said, we ordered white shelves, these are blue. And they're like, did you take off the protective tape? Oh. Oh, the blue protective tape. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I'll, I'll take it off now. I misread the instructions. I just realized I dated myself as well by not holding a smartphone. Oh my god. I remember when I was on the phone with, uh, with IKEA guys. <laughs> I don't think kids do this, right? <laughs> Alright guys, sub to the grub if you enjoyed. See you next time with more.